All right, welcome back, everyone. So now that we've played with the Tribunal, we're going to go into the action deck here. And now this is a deck that I have very little experience with, which means I'm going to get my ass beat a lot. Probably. I don't know. We'll see. So there's a... As usual, in most games, there, there's three ways that a game can go. You can either have a landslide victory, or... A uh, horrific loss, or you guys can be pretty evenly matched and you can just barely win, or you can barely lose. One of those two. So I guess four. Um, but still, as long as I don't get just murdered, I tend not to care too much. But uh, yeah. Ooh, the ice wraith, perfect. So we're gonna skip. Um, I think my plan is we'll get to five, or we'll get we'll get to four. I'll play the ice wraith. And we'll get to five, play her. Then we can kind of go from there. So I'm going to play that just so I can get another creature. Oh, thank God I can play that now. I just need something on the board before I get my, my Ice Wraith and my the the Wraith out there. The knows no bounds. Okay. What I'll do is I'll summon them and them. Just to kind of... Make it seem like I'm going hard on the left lane there. Ooh, he's got a keyword deck. So that, anytime he summons a card, it gets a keyword. You dare face our wizard lord. So what I'll do now is I'll attack with uh, this last grasp. Grisp, grasp. This person. How about you worthless to kill that and trigger her exalt. Blade. I think his exalt was put a random action in his hand, worst. so he has a random action now, but whatever, that's fine. So next time we're going to get her, and then after that we're going to start using my, my actions to kind of build up our action deck. It'll be great. So he's going to build a custom action, or custom creature, I should say. Yeah, we'll see what happens. So next turn, I'll get two cards because the uh, the Ice Wraith will trigger, and I'll have that uh, the card that I can just toss and do stuff with. So, oh boy, the Ice Wraith is gonna get one attack and one only. So I could save it with this, but I don't want to. I want to get this card out there right now. Oof, I was really hoping I could play that card still. I'm, I'm dumb. So, uh... What I'll do, though... Is I'll equip her with this card. Do your worst. I'm gonna attack directly here, and I'm just gonna... I'm gonna make him attack me. If he wants to kill that card, he's gonna have to attack me. Or waste a card. I'm not gonna kill him on purpose. You motherfucker! Oh. Okay. Well, I'm killing that card right now, then. So I can play this card right now. Let's do this. Let's shed some light get my fireball. Then I can use the fireball and kill them. And I can summon this high go person here and first. get that. Yes. I'm ready for you. Then do that. All right. I play pretty fast, so don't understand what happened. I played this card to get a fireball because they have a thing where you summon them and you have all your next card is going to be an intelligence one. You uh, you gain that. So what we'll do next is summon her again. I'm gonna give an iron sword to this girl here so I can kill this card there. So we're gonna do that, and we're gonna do that. By the gods, what do you got? Yeah! Got a shackle, okay. And a ward, apparently. That's fine. All right, have your turn. Oh yay, a lame corpus, excellent. And it's got drain, so what we'll do is we'll use lightning bolt on it, Today, and we'll use fire bolt on it. <clears throat> to uh, destroy the corpus. That way it can't deal more damage to this card than necessary. 
Okay. Lightning bolt. Fireballs. <clears throat> Guard. Kill that creature. Kill that. So the reason why I attacked that card rather than uh, attacking directly with that is because at the beginning of the opponent's turn, a random creature gains plus one, plus one um, to their attack and to their defense. So that means the uh, the harpy would have gained uh, plus one, plus one, and had three, two. Um, whereas now, it's just a random fucking harpy. So, yeah. So we'll see what happens next. Next, I should be able to play Trader's Flame and the Ice Spike key here. Oh, you have four damage, huh? You piece of shit. I wanted to summon more creatures in the right lane. There we go. There we go. Lethal? Motherfuck. God damn. Of course he has lethal. Fuck. So, okay, thank God. Um, so what was bad about him having lethal is because he deals damage when he's summoned, that means his summon has lethal. So uh, that would have been really bad. If, uh... Oof. So I just got so many Trader Flames in my deck right now. Um, we're gonna do this. And we're gonna do that. Now, Alright, so we got a lot of zero cost cards in my deck right now. This is turning out pretty well. Um, I think next turn, unless I get a good action that I want to use, we're gonna do this guy. This day is mine. So this guy does, if he has a ward, he, uh... <laughs> Son of a bitch! Of course. Of course that's how that worked. Motherfucker. <sighs> okay. That's fine. That is fine. Perhaps we can help one another. I'm gonna save this traitor flame for later. I'm gonna let him just attack me. Because he can attack me and I won't lose anything. Because that uh, this card right here, if he has a ward, I gain a ward. Which means I can't be attacked or damaged the first time I get hit. Which is nice. So. Also, the stupid rock slide card here just sucks. I hate it. Oh. I am Tosh. I will end you. Okay. I mean, that was, that was a thing, certainly. Die, okay, Outlander. so what we'll do is we'll attack him with this to trigger that. I'm gonna attack him with this to trigger that. I'm gonna hit him with the Traitor's Flame to do that. Then I'm gonna not do it again. Sorry, it had to come. I'm gonna to attack this guy directly here to do that. Then we'll summon this boy here. We'll summon this guy here. The winds favor us. Oh, excellent! That'll come in handy. And then we'll summon this gal here. Let's shed some light on the problem. And unless he has something crazy that can happen next turn, I should win this. This is actually really, a uh, really, really good, good draw for me here. Like, I was not expecting to be able to do half the shit I was doing here. Like that Trader's Flame zero cost card, just perfect. Oh, I'll have to wait an extra turn before I win. So that card you just used shackles all my creatures, which means they can't attack next turn. So they're pretty much all useless at the moment. But that's fine. So that card gained Drain, which. Yeah, it doesn't like matter because it can't attack me. He gained guard, and his items are less. So what I can do is I can just kill that blacksmith because I do not want him to be able to equip cards for cheaper. All right, what do we get next? I'll reduce the cost of an action. Excellent. So we'll go ahead and just thunderbolt him real quick, and then we will. I don't want to do anything yet. 
Yeah, I'll save these. I just didn't want to have him have like a bunch of different uh, items that he could equip to that card and make it like a, a badass crazy card for less. There's life in this old thing. Yeah, oh, he equips two items. This might do in a well, pinch. Good for him. And he gained ward. Excellent. Close ranks. Let fine. Nothing through. That's less fine. I might lose actually now. Shit. Let's heat things up. God damn it. Goran glory. <clears throat> okay. So here's what we gotta have to do. Choices, choices. First of all, we need a guard in this lane. Enemy spotted. So I can do that. Excellent. Sorry I had to come to this. Guards take you. Take him out. Okay, I can do this. I can do this. This is fine. Hit him. I have you Finish now. him. Kill him. So he'll have to attack him. Summon this card. Your destruction is at hand. And we'll wait. The elements are mine to control. I stand behind my work. Don't give him guard. Thank you. I win. Think you can take me either. Excellent. Excellent. Well, I might win. We'll You've see. gotta go through him first. I'll learn. I'll learn. Spell. 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 That was a kind of close game. If he would have had another guard in the right lane, I would not have won this turn. And I would have probably, I would definitely have lost. Like, it all came down if he had a guard on that last card he had. But, uh, thank God he didn't. So that was the, uh, the action deck. Pretty cool. Um, I wish I could have drawn more actions or used more actions before that card died, but, eh, I think it served its purpose. So next, a similar deck, the keyword and equip deck. So this deck's great because you can just like uh, equip things and keyword things and it's oh so beautiful. Basically, I once had a card that I buffed up to deal like 20 damage a hit. And it was just unstoppable because it would like uh, it had regenerate on it, which means every time it was my turn, it would regenerate. But you could not kill it unless you had like a, an instant destroy card. It was beautiful. Few times up a little bit. Alrighty. Ho oh, ho, oh, perfect. So I'm gonna get rid of that, keep that and that. I'm keeping this one because every time it's my turn, I can get a random item. Or it does I don't get a random item, I get a it changes into a random item. So First thing we'll do is we'll summon this guy here. Let's do this. Yeah, definitely there. Okay, all perfect. I don't want him to die right away. Summon. There's only so much Enter. Honor can allow. And now I have this hammer, which doubles the wielder's power and health, but I can only attack creatures, which sucks. It's a good weapon, but um, I don't like only being able to attack creatures. Talos. So that'll change into another thing my next turn. Ah, bloody hell. Well, that's fine with me. I hope I get a creature next turn. I did. Excellent. So what I can do here My is attack, has buff him up, and I can do this to place my keyword card. Hell yeah. Now, any item I get, 
I'll have an extra thing. Elfjord's ring. Give this creature's keywords to other friendly creatures. Huh. Curse you. No. Okay. Yeah. But he's just gonna start fucking me up right now. But when he fucks me up, I gain more uh, more stuff. So that's also good for me. Good for me. Okay. Oh, oh hell yeah. Two for one. Excellent. All right. We'll stand I'm gonna summon this card because he'll break off into another guard once he's killed. A grappling hook. Ooh, excellent. That means that lane on the left is safe for those two attacks. Unless he, of course, deals damage like that and is a bitch. Well, regardless, I killed one of them, so. It's fine with me. <coughs> Unless he has another card to just kill me. In which case, fuck him. Come on, play your cards. There we go. Son of a bitch. I might lose before I even get a creature out there that I can buff up. Damn it. We can't reach an arrangement. I keep a spare blade in my boot. Now oh, this card has guard. Excellent. Power to become a oh, huh. That'd be good if I had a really high defense creature. Monster is three. You got another card. Of course you fucking do. So we can just kill my my guy there. Excellent. <sighs> Oh my god, if he has one fucking item. Okay, perfect. I can survive this. It'll be fine. Okay, I'm so first of all, kill that card real quick. <laughs> Alright, I just need to get the... Uh, let's go with dagger. Oops, go with dagger, I said. I sharpen weapons. Kill him. Don't care to wield them. Let me get this guy out Let's here. Let's see if we can't reach an arrangement. I'm gonna play that. If he has a charge, a card with charge, I'm fucked. Hey, turn back into that. Interesting. Uh, fuck. That's fine. Alright, so I gotta use this card here. I ride like the wind. There we go. I sharpen weapons. Don't care to wield them. So if he has anything that deals like one damage to me, I'm fucked. But we'll see if I can come back from this. Might not be able to. What do you have? This card's gonna be useless. I will not be able to gain more health than him unless I get a card with drain on it. The watch is mine. Son of a Bitch, of course he had that card. You know, that card should only affect it after, um, if you try to shackle someone afterwards. It should not, like, unshackle creatures. That's just dumb. Motherfucker. I need another guard. Like, right now. Into the fray. Fuck. Hope I lost. I sharpen weapons. 
But I'll just fuck him up, so. Kind of. Show him that I could have killed him next turn if he didn't, if I had a fucking guard. Ah! Yeah, we lost. If we would have had, like, uh, any anything to begin with, card wise, um, it would have been much better. We kind of got shafted having just items there. That's, that's the kind of risk that I take with this deck. I either get a good draw, or I get fucked. So there's no in between. Because, I mean, I could get, like, just all items for the first, like, six rounds if I get that bad of RNG here. Oh, man, he has silence. He has destroy cards. That's, that's not working well against for me. Yep, okay, so we'll get rid of that one, that one, and we'll, we'll keep this one for now. I just want to make sure I have at least one creature at some point, so... Okay, perfect. That's a good, good starting hand. It would have been better if I would have had my, uh, my thing in it, but, you know, whatever. My Fire Imp can deal a little bit of damage here while I think. Alright. Let's see what happens. So I'm gonna get my Fire Imp out here. So this card, uh, it changes between Dawn Fang and Dusk Fang at the end of my turns. Um, Dust Fang, whenever I pilfer, I draw a card. And Dawn Fang, whenever I uh, kill a monster, I gain health. Um, I feel like Dusk Fang would definitely be the best one. Since uh, I don't do a lot of slaying. And I mean, even if I do slay something, unless I have like a card that has regenerate, it's going to be wasted. I'll only be able to do it, like, once or twice, so... Is whatever. But I need a card to use next turn, so hopefully the draw is uh, in my favor. You won't escape alive! Fuck! Um, give me a steel sword? No? Fuck me. Well, I'm going to die! At least I'll do more damage to you than you'll have dealt to me. So next turn I can use my uh, my survivalist guy here, and then I'll be able to equip him with the Dro armor next turn. You won't escape alive. And he's going hard on that side, huh? End of the road. I mean, if you want to have those cards there, I don't mind. So let me. I'm just gonna do this. More than likely, he has a silence. So next turn, my plan is draw armor, use the ring. And then use the steel scimitar. Maybe I'll just use the steel dagger, actually. I might just use the steel dagger. Because I don't need four, five, six, seven. I don't need seven health right now. Yeah, I'll do that. That way, if um, when I get six, I can use this and give her the steel scimitar. I don't want to waste all my high items and be silenced on them. So. Let's see what he plays here. This opponent sucks. He takes way too long to choose his cards. Thank you! This one, thanks. Oh my god. I totally do not care that he played my, that silence there. Because that plus one plus one thing he has is just, I don't care. It does not matter. What matters is the items. By Diagno's breath. So I could have equipped him with this, but I'm good. If he gets an item here, I'm going to play Dawn Fang on him, just so I can get that slay. Otherwise, I'm going to save it until next turn, then play it, and then get the Pilfer. We'll see what happens. See, this is a problem with my opponents. Sometimes they just take too fucking long doing their stuff. It's annoying. Like, as you play your cards... You should have a general idea of what you're going to be doing. 
Like, for example, while I'm waiting for him to attack, my next move is probably going to be to summon this guy in that lane and give him a little bit of a buff. Fuck me. Great. Okay. Well, that's fine. Because I can equip him with this to give him a breakthrough. Over there with that. I'm gonna go here with this. Go here with that. Kind of just deal him a little extra damage here. Only one of us this. shall survive. So for this, he has to attack me with this one first, and then with that one to kill me. If he attacks that one first and then that one, I win. We'll see what happens. Come on, mess up the order. Mess up the order. Come on, you know you wanna. Tell me your injuries. I am a hunter. I am a redeemer. I am a Jiu. Damn, he did not fuck up the order. Oh, that's fine. Oh? Ruptiga guides my hand. I'm gonna do that then. You dare to I mean, I'll, I'll just attack. I don't. I don't care. Only one and of us then, shall survive. Let's do. Fuck it. I'm just gonna attack her. No attack. I'll just go through it. So next turn, I can equip I the uh, the dancer with some items here and then it'll just attack or deal damage to them but uh hindsight it doesn't matter now ha you have no keywords get fucked Ooh, perfect this will work this will work i'm glad i got dawn fang here now i can equip it to him slay that card Get a 5 health bonus. Still attack him there. Actually, no way! I have lethal! I have fucking lethal! What am I doing? <clears throat> I was like, yeah, let me just do all this weird, crazy, fucking crazy stuff. But no. No. I have lethal. It has been an engaging hunt. Uh, what you doing, buddy? Just gonna waste my time because you're gonna lose? I mean, you have one mana left. I think he's gonna waste my time because he's gonna lose. I've done that before um, to people. Um, only when they've had like really shitty decks where it's like just when they've been fucking with me. I had one guy. He was like, Purposefully not killing me. Like, I had no creatures on my field, and he had, like, his entire row filled. But, uh, yeah, it was just kind of fucked up of him. It has been an engaging that we can do for Yay, win. Excellent. Well, we didn't really showcase this deck too well. Um, so let's just go ahead and do another one, shall we? One more with the keyword and equip jet. It didn't really get showcased too well, I feel, because we didn't actually have my, uh, my keyword thing down there, so... That was, uh, not a good time. Not a good time. Yeah. There we go. Ooh, a strength only guy. That is actually very good for me. Because strength has very few silences. And they're very rare too, so I mean if he doesn't have one right off the bat. Okay. Perfect. My phone rang and it was telemarketers or some stupid credit card thing. Yeah. 
All right. Mm. So rally here, then this boy here, and then her somewhere else. Actually, I'm gonna save her until I get my uh, my keyword thing. But uh, that's the order. One, two, and I don't know when. <coughs> bright, bright the moons, moons light your path. path. Ooh, excellent. There's only so you know what? much that honor can allow. I'm gonna do that. Isn't the lock that will keep this one out? Why you ask? Well, because now we'll have to choose which lane to protect. Because that one gets my people stronger. This one, I gain more mana and health each turn. So it is a beautiful, beautiful chance to do things that are great. All right. If you're going to defend that one, I will put my guy in that lane. But first... My family has endured enough. Ah, I did not do the one I wanted. Oh, well. <clears throat> put them there. So much for a clean now let's escape. do this. I could play them now. Hmm. Do it. This might be handy. I'll kind of split lanes. This card, like I said, great. Anytime I can incorporate this card into a deck, I do it. This is just a very generic shulker. Shuttler? Shuttler? I don't know. Some names are weird for me to pronounce. I can't I can pronounce them properly for some reason. I don't know. Anyway. What do you got? Break you and plus three plus three, huh? Mm. Okay. I feel you. Right, give me something good to eat here, deck. Come on. Give me something good. Excellent. If you want to kill me, you're going to have to fucking kill me. And kill yourself. Don't so let's go. Estimate me. My family has endured enough. So much for a clean escape. You dare too much. Right, so I'm going to save this card up here because I can't use it anyway. But uh, when I actually do get to use it, assuming he doesn't kill my rally card right off the bat here, I will have a good card to use on my sixth turn. Or the fifth turn. That'll be the sixth because you start off with a one, so. Indeed. We'll see. I really hope I get my uh, my keyword support here pretty quick. This day will be mine. Oh, you motherfucker! Attack me directly, though. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Back and get down. You owe Wait. Oh my god, I can summon the brawler now. Ha, 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 ha. So I'm going to kill that first. So I'm going to escape. gain health and mana and use that and summon the brawler. Yeah, boy. Now, assuming he doesn't put a guard in that lane to just fuck my day up, it should be good. Yeah, 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 yeah. Two random items. Okay, so he's gonna waste that. What are you doing? What are you doing, opponent? Time to march. Does he have a zero cost item? Please tell me he doesn't. <gasps> he doesn't! Yes! Okay. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. A this guy. Arm is what you need. This one. So much for a clean this. You and then this. this. Boom. 
Oof, okay. Unless he has some really good items to really buff those two creatures to kill my Khajiit. I don't think I'm going to have a problem here. Actually, I have lethal next turn if he doesn't kill that card, so... Whatever he feels like doing! Again, could not grit the goddamn keyword altar. He's an enchantment table, right? Hmm. He has to at least have two items. So, there we go. He can kill me. Perfect. Question is, is he going to? Or how's he going to go about it? Okay, does he have one more? Does he have one more item to equip? That's the question. For the grave. My own Perfect. Okay. Made him waste a bunch of stuff on that card. Excellent. And now I don't have lethal, so we can like actually do something here. All right. Um. You know what? Let's go with the this, this guy. Boop, boop. Might do in a pinch. Attack. 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 I'm gonna equip this guy to that just to reduce our cost by one, and then we'll continue. Cause I got lethal again. It really sucks I'm not getting my support item. So I really want to show you guys how great it is once you get them down. And then, like, just start burning through cards. It's beautiful. Especially if you get the, uh, the support item and this guy. This herd needs thinning. It's just beautiful. Oh, he sounds cool. That means uh, he's going to silence my big boy so I can't lethal him, right? Right? Do it! Do it! Dude, you coward. I have six, seven. I still have seven, so if I get an item, I win. <sighs> Let's see. Come and warm yourself. I mean, this is just a crushing, a crushing victory. Like, I feel a back. I'm kind of bad for this guy that I'm destroying him so, so utterly. Like he's not even hurt me yet. I mean, he has, but I mean, I have more health than thirty now, so. You are the victor. Oh, okay. I mean, I wouldn't have been able to kill you unless I got an item, but okay. Granted, half my deck has items, so. It was probably going to happen. Alright, so every three victories you get a pile of gold and some uh, random card. This is actually one of the better cards I've seen so far. Yeah. Alright, one more time. And we'll see if I can actually get my keyword support item out there. Because this is a keyword and item deck, not a item deck. We've seen a lot of the item side of it, not a lot of the keyword side of it. That's kind of irritating, don't you think? Okay. Keep her, get rid of him, get rid of him. Okay, he's good. I can use him on turn four to get a guard down. I keep a spare blade in my boot. Ah, uh, he's got silence. Damn. He's got at least six of them, too. Or he can have about at least six. Assuming he has three silences and then three of the uh, silence and deal one damage cards that are from the purple-blue assortment. Don't underestimate me. Let's see what happens. I got my Brawler, which I can use on turn six, which is cool. Okay, perfect. Here, let's do this. And then that. If nothing else, I can just get him to, uh, you know, kill that card. 
or silence it, whichever. Oh boy, he's got a lethal. Can I get my bow of silencing? That's the question. Drum roll, please. I did not, so we're gonna gamble on a, uh, a royal sage, giving him a ward. Come on, ward. He got ward! Oh, ho, ho! Shit, yeah! So I, uh, I attacked that guy rather than attacking his life points, because if he had a card that dealt one damage or anything to that card, I would have lost my ward. Then he could have just lethaled it. So I just eliminated the possibility, and I was like, fuck it, let's just do that. So we're good. Okay. So next, I think what we'll do is we'll play this card and then the Sage. Transform a creature in your hand into a random legend. Oh, that sucks. Oh, let's get something good. Nope. What do we get? I slay the unworthy. Another one? Damn. Damn, girl. Okay. I got a ward. Okay. So we'll summon her. I keep a spare blade in my boot. And we'll summon her. I see you're in need of my wisdom. Lethal, lethal. Another ward! <laughs> oh my god. I feel almost bad for that guy. The fact that I got a ward twice. Suffer and die. And now a third time too if I uh if he summons another lethal down there. Jesus, that's just not fair. That I got a ward twice on him like that. I also got a bunch of lethal creatures, so that's also cool. <sighs> So he has a random action. What action do you have, buddy? Something fun? Something that's gonna kill one of my cards? Is that it, huh? So I guess now we've seen a little bit of play with the keywords and what they can do. So that's pretty cool. I really want my, uh, my, my altar, though. So also, I could just play my brawler right now and uh, start racking shit up, because he has nothing in his lane. And I have two lethals, so I mean, if I summon it and he summons guards, I can just lethal the shit out of them. But, uh... <laughs> oh, baby. I can, uh... I can put a ward on this gal and just fuck him up. That's dirty. That is dirty. What I get, what I get, what I get. Okay, nothing good. Brawler. Will find a way. Ward. You can't just kill. 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 What prophecy did you get, buddy? Something good? Okay. Don't underestimate me. I'm ready for you. I have you now. There we go. All right, next turn I have win. Doop, boop, boop, ba doop. Unless he got something crazy. Uh, I mean, he did just turn a card into a little. Yeah, no, never mind. Ah, nope, he can't get Vivek. Actually, can't exalt Vivek, I guess. would be the thing, but. Oh. He's shackled permanently. Oh, my. For sure, I still win. Like, regardless. But, <clears throat> here's what we'll do. Lethal, buff on that, and kill. Don't underestimate me. It has been an engagement. You underestimate time. this one. All right, well, we, we unfortunately have not gotten lucky enough to see the uh, the support item for the keyword deck. But I think we understand all of what the keyword and equip stuff does now that we actually got two sages out there. And for me, those sages feel like they're kind of rare to get actually to work there because I either don't have enough health or I don't have any creatures on the board to actually matter for it. So we'll end things there when we come back next time.
we'll do the Drain and Health deck and the Dagoth deck. And then we'll kind of see what happens on those two. So until next time, everyone, catch you later. Bye now.